Is that? Thank you, sir. Okay. Much appreciated. Thank you, One Million Cups. Really, really feel grateful to be here today with you guys. I uh, appreciate the opportunity. Uh, my partner Adam is over there and our wives and family. Uh, we have opened a co-working space in downtown Ocala, Florida. You guys might wonder what co-working is. Uh, it's the use of an office or other working environment by people who are self-employed or working different, uh, for different employers typically so as to share equipment, ideas, and knowledge. The goal for us uh, in Ocala is to bring like-minded, creative go-getters uh, and combine them in the same building and we want to feed off of each other. We want the environment to be fun. We want people to be successful. Uh, I want to give uh, the knowledge that I've uh, come up with in 15 years uh, in sales with small business owners. My partner Adam has been in uh, sales for 20 years and we want to help people be successful. The whole idea of co-working is to bring bright, creative people together uh, and let the ideas collide. And I think if you guys come and see our place, I think you'll see what I'm talking about. Our mission statement is to create a co-working community that encourages professional growth, success, networking, idea sharing, talent development, while serving as a resource for thriving members and our community. A uh, little bit about co-working. So just some stats. By 2020, 51% of companies will have some type of shared office space. 82% of people that join co-working spaces say it has expanded their business network and increased their productivity. 50% uh, report higher income when working in a, uh, for traditional offices. 89% of people are happier making the shift to co-working. And 69% learned or improved existing skills. And so by, by getting people together in a, in a building uh, from different backgrounds, different industries, uh, and having the opportunity for them to uh, talk, talk through problems, share ideas, our co-working space has a uh, state-of-the-art conference center. It has a podcast room. Uh, so we're trying to uh, bring many different industries together uh, and see if we can push each other to uh, accomplish new heights. Uh, we are month to month. The bi one of the biggest things that Adam and I wanted to do when we opened this was we wanted to be flexible for small business owners. So there's no long-term uh, contracts. There's no requirement to tell us if you need to leave. Uh, we have all of my memberships month to month include all of the following. So we have fiber running into the building. Uh, we have an on-site community manager that can be your receptionist. If you are a new business and you don't have a business phone line, we can assign one to you. If you already have a business phone line, we can import that in. And then my community manager, her name is Chelsea, she can start taking your calls. Forwarding messages, helping you set appointments, schedule caterings, uh, things like that. Uh, all of my memberships include utilities, a weekly cleaning service. We have printing uh, services on site. We're providing uh, basic office supplies. I mentioned the state-of-the-art conference center with video conferencing and uh, teleconferencing equipment. Uh, all of my members have 24-7 access to the building. Our members pick a four-digit code. The same four-digit code that they use to access the front and back door is the same code they use to turn on and off the alarm. It's the same four-digit code they use to access the printer. And each member does get a free beer a day. We've partnered with Brooklyn's Backyard and Infinite Ale and things like that. So one free beer a day for everybody. I mean, come on, who's not behind <laughs> something like that? Uh, we do have Sonos music in the building. So if you're working, you can uh, uh, decide what kind of music you want to listen to. We are very proud to partner with Dignity Roasters. So each member gets free coffee, unlimited. We have French press, Nespresso, uh, cold uh, regular coffee, uh, and decaf. And then we're providing organic snacks, private soundproof phone booths if you need to have a, a, a private conversation, and free parking uh, as well. Uh, those are our co-working plans. Uh, it, basic membership is $199 a month. It includes all of those amenities. We do have three private offices. Uh, and those uh, start at 12.50 and they go up from there. And again, that's month to month, inclusive of all of that. Uh, so think about that from a small business perspective. You don't want to sign a three-year lease. We're providing flexibility and all of the tools you need to be successful. Today, you can walk in as a new business and have a receptionist, a voicemail, uh, and, a, and, uh, and a fully functional office. And we happen to be having our grand opening today too. So we have live music, Chris McNeil, we have beer, food, wine. Uh, we would love for you guys to come out and celebrate with us and take a look at the building. We spent six months renovating that building in downtown Ocala, 603 East Fort King. I think uh, it'll speak for itself, but we would love for you guys to come out there and join uh, our celebration. 
And that's it. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about your business and why One Million Cups. You thought it was important to be here today. Yeah, we're a co-working space in downtown Ocala, and we're just looking for local businesses, uh, startup uh, businesses, freelancers that want to come out and join a community of people that are pushing them to do more. When you say a uh, workspace uh, community, is it for singles, doubles, a large company, small company? Yeah, we can accommodate anybody, whether you're a, a, a owner only, you have a couple of employees, or it's uh, two of you, we can accommodate it, and we want you to come out and, and be part of the community. And one of the things you offer is a podcasting station, I heard. Yes, sir. We have a podcast room. It's available for uh, rent on an hourly basis or for the day. And we also have a conference room. Uh, it's everything state of the art. It's brand new. Well, Zach, thanks for all you do, and thanks for helping out the Ocala community. Sir, thank you. I appreciate it.